Okay. All right. The last video. Okay. You have to understand the the uh, her frame of mind. Okay. Um, tomorrow we have the uh, priest coming over on Sunday for some Christmas thing. I have no idea. I'm cooking, and uh, I would rather just make the dish and leave. But I can't say anything. You see, the whole thing is is my daughter has a scholarship. You know, with this, with, with with the Catholic Church and everything. Um, but uh, she's <laughs> she's in no mood for any conversation at all whatsoever about anything. I could talk to her about her new car she's gonna buy. She wouldn't even want to talk about it. So, flat Earth? Oh no, not a good topic to bring up. So I'm sitting there trying to explain to her. That at one point when we were growing up, we were told our solar system was stationary. Remember that? You know, the sun was not moving. It was just revolving. You know, I mean, it was revolving within itself. You know, it was a magna core of, of molten lava and, and all this... It, <sighs> incredible things, you know, that you just can't possibly fucking imagine, you know, I mean, it was just incredible that these uh, explosions are happening, that are creating these disturbances on our planet, <laughs> which is such bullshit, such nonsense, garbage. I'm not going to say I know everything, but I know we don't live in space. I know a lot more than other people think that I know. However, the last video was me um, putting a, a little thing in the, in the uh, microwave, you know, door. That was to, to make the stars, okay? And um, I was showing the pumpkin that we still have, by the way. This is a little contest we like to, to, to do. And we try to get the best pumpkin from one of the areas and, and see how long it lasts. It's really neat. I had one that lasted until June, believe it or not. I bought, it, I bought that one in, um, in Montauk. So the sun is stationary. This is me growing up and learning about science. The sun is stationary. It's right here. It's 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 a it's a molted core, you know, this energy just revolving around itself, you know, just going like this and this. And all the planets are around it. But but they're not moving. They're just rotating around this enormous amount of fucking gravity okay all right that's what i learned but then i turn around and then all of a sudden fuck 20 years later we have a sun traveling through the fucking universe in this tremendous speed with planets going around it and the stars in the fucking background that are not moving and they'll never move. And that's what pisses me off. These fucking scientists can say anything to anybody. And they'll believe it. And they do. Go up to somebody right now. They probably won't even know. They don't care. You know, I'll ask this guy right here. Do you know that the solar system is traveling through the universe? Traversing through the galaxy? And with, with all this gravitational pull, but yet the, the stars don't move, the constellations don't move. The, the, the very same Big Dipper you saw when you were a child has not moved from that one position at all. They don't care. They just don't care. I mean, they're just so trained. 
trained and lost. Anyway. She's there. It's just a New York woman. You know, that's how they are. Um, Merry Christmas. I get so pissed off this time of year. Even more now. I just do. I don't get pissed off of people. I just get pissed off at the whole advertising stunt. You can't even get on your phone anymore. You can't even... You can't do anything to get away of this nonsense of just bullshit. Just selling crap that you don't need. And it means nothing. I mean, it really does. It means nothing at all. The only thing it does mean is that you get together with your family. Don't buy these stupid gifts and this nonsense that's out there. And don't fall for it. I try not to, but then what are you going to buy your significant other? You know, what are you going to buy for everybody else? They need something. They want something in return because they gave you something. You see, that's what they do. I thank you for subbing. I thank you for a view of my channel and let me be a part of your life.